guys i hope you all doing very very wonderful today <laughs> um i this is a really long video so as for now i don't have any plans on making a voiceover during this whole entire video but i do wanted to come in and say that so the video is kind of long because i didn't use any like fast forwarding kind of um type of um, editing on the video yes maybe at the end while i was like putting something basically literally at the end of the video i fast forward a little bit i caught here and there um basically it, sometimes i caught like maybe two to three times and it's because um I, there's a part where i didn't do anything because i was looking for something um or i was like I don't know what I was doing, but I know that I wasn't even like touching the notebook and I was like, okay I'm gonna cut it here because it will, it will be really dumb for me to like let like a minute or two of me Not doing any journaling. So I did cut it So it's a little bit more like a real time with me like journal with me in the cruise This is the library guys. I was really excited. It was my first video in the cruise my first video in the cruise was in the library. I think I managed um, a way to like lose my fear on recording videos in public. I will say that it's a lot easier when you're not looking in the camera, like when you're vlogging in, like in um, around people. Of course, you're looking at the camera. People are looking at you, so it's weird. But when you have the camera pointing at something else or someone else. Is you don't feel like that much of a shy person you know um, so I to be honest it was a lot easier to make this video and there was people coming in and out all the time this one lady that I think she got mad at me because um, I was recording in the area I don't know if she wanted to sit in it and I was like well it's, there, there's still two like um, couches that you can sit on you know I was only taking one couch or maybe two yeah two couches but that's basically it like there was no one um, sitting in the in that area and there was like a lot of other places that she could sit so I don't know if she looked at me weird because she wanted to sit there or because I was recording in a in a place doing journaling stuff and like playing with paper and all that I don't know the reasons but I was like, you know what, I'm not going to be minded by this. <laughs> so um, it was a really, really fun experience. I was going to do another one in the pizzeria, but it was always too busy. Um, there was like a lot of people, a lot of noise. So I wasn't going to be able to do a um, kind of like what I'm doing right now. You know, I did put some music in the background on this video, but it's... I didn't put it too high so you can still listen hear everything I'm doing I put music on because well I kind of like it with the music on um, but I did I don't like videos that you can hear like what they do and plus the music is so high that you basically cannot hear what they're doing it's like very little you can hear very little that's not the type of um, kind of videos I like um, I don't like the music too loud so I know a lot of people like the S A S, -A -S I don't even know how to say that. <laughs> but I know a lot of people like that. And I'm not that kind of type of person. I don't like it. And But if you guys want me to do a video like that, let me know. Here in my parents' academy, it's a lot easier for me to do a video like that. Because there's no noise. I have air conditioning, so I don't um, need a fan. But in my house, you can hear, like, my brother's dog. Or, well, I have talked about this before. It's really noisy at home plus the fan it doesn't really help <laughs> so um yeah but I, I was really happy that I was able to make this I did another video and this journal with me is going to be on my um I was in the room so it, I have to take two um like different videos because I was I was I thought I was going to make or do the whole journaling um, spread before going to dinner but I didn't so I have to like record it a little bit and then stop get ready go to dinner and then when I come back I finish doing my video it took a long time to do that video so yeah <laughs> but I'm really happy uh, that one is going to be fast forward a little bit because it's really long and um, also 
I, I, I don't, I don't want to give you guys a really long video. I enjoy long videos. I love it. I always look for videos that are like longer than than all of you guys. But I like videos that are like 20, 30, 40 minutes long. I love it because that gives me time to do all the things while I'm watching the video. I can journal at the same time. I can uh, put my um, clothes, <laughs> like hang my clothes, like do something, clean the room, whatever I'm doing. And I like, you know, I watch it and then I keep doing what I'm doing. And then I go and keep watching the video. I really like it. I don't know about you guys, but I do enjoy those kind of uh, videos. So, yes. Um, so, you guys know that uh, I said I wasn't going to talk too much. And I was just going to come in and, and log out. But apparently, that didn't happen. But I know, well, <laughs> no promises. But I don't think that I will be staying to the end of this video. I think so. I don't think so. <laughs> so, um and you guys know that I have a passport that is what I journal with and that's what I carry with me and I love that size to that it's just like an amazing since, since I got a passport when I okay let me say it I got first an A5 I'm gonna do a video about that later um because I have uh, a video I have a I'm planning a video for a um a book that I want to talk to you guys about so the video is not just about the book the video is about journaling and it's about um the ways that i journal and all that stuff plus the book so i don't want to tell you anything about the name of the book i don't want to tell you anything because i want you i want it, i want you to see the video when i upload it and not know what i'm what i'm going to be talking about or whatever so i want to be a surprise you know like every other video that i do but um, it's going to be a very interesting video. So I I always been a passport girl. I love small. Um, okay, I apologize. My mom called me. There's a whole dilemma uh, about a credit card. Or, so, yes. <laughs> so if my voice sounds different or something in the, in the voiceover sounds different, that is it. <laughs> so um, like I was saying, I always been a kind of girl that likes like small um, journals so I really enjoy that I don't know why so I did try my pocket notebook and I did finish and ended that whole notebook it was a goal for me I was like I need to finish this I need to so it took me half a, a year to finish that which actually I was super surprised because for me I have never finished a whole notebook that it's like a journal notebook i have never ever finished a whole notebook like never in my entire life like well actually yes i did i'm you know what i did because i did buy some inserts when i was like getting into the journaling kind of um lifestyle and um i did buy an insert that it was like a travel notebook size and i finished that one yes i did i'm sorry i'm lying yes i did but um yeah i was just really uh, happy and then I was like you know what I'm gonna try passport because that's the one that I have and that's the one that I, I like using I always use uh, my passport for planning when I first started planning was my passport size and then I was like I should use it for journaling which before before like you know thinking about it I was like that is kind of crazy because this is so small <laughs> but um, using it through like what it has been like two months already and I think I really, really love it. So I am going through a few stuff right now. I want to get a few passport. Um, I want to get a Traveler's Notebook Company passport. I want to get a real Traveler's Notebook passport. And I also want to get a Chick Sparrow, maybe two to three from her because um, Jennifer has so many beautiful leathers so and passport size are really inexpensive i also don't use the pocket kind of like style you know because i have my own inserts that have their pockets i also thinking about buying a leather pocket that is from um, a store in aliexpress and i love 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 this person because i have ordered from him before and their store is really good and it's real leather and they're really beautiful so i'm thinking about getting also that insert for like um it's a zipper and kind of like a wallet type i use them for stickers and all that stuff so i don't really have the need to buy a 
traveler's notebook with pockets in it because I really got used to not using pockets in my traveler's notebook. So um, I do have a passport, which is a passport plus from Chick Sparrow when I got it last year. And um, I use it for journaling, like basically every day. You can literally see that it was really used. But I, I don't use it anymore. I did also got two passport from Printpression. Those are not leather, so if you're vegan or um, have a friend that is vegan, um, Printpression does make really good, pa really um, good leather. But I mean, not leather. I'm sorry, Travis notebook. But I, to be honest, they are more going. They look more for planner than journaling. He doesn't have like the only color I would say it will look good for journaling will be the black one because everything is like so pink. I mean. I'm sorry, but I'm not a pink girl. I don't like covers that are shiny red, um, red or like um, green or anything like that. I like my stuff a little bit muted and his is really vibrant. And basically all his like TMs, they're like pinky and all that stuff. And that's not my vibe. <laughs> so I do have two, no two Travelers notebooks. They're really chunky and that's why they don't really work for me because you have to put like a bunch of inserts so you can fill that up and no I'm thinking about selling them I have one in green which is beautiful love it love it love it it's a really beautiful um, passport and I actually customized the elastic and the stitching but um, I do have another one which is a oh my god um, it's a purpley one and I did customize that one as well so that's not my color I thought it was going to look um, like mobby or something like that but when I got it it was a purple and that's not what they were advertising in the shop so I really haven't used it like literally I put some like um, rings in it just to see how it looks with rings but that's it I haven't used it at all so I'm thinking about selling them both if I can. They're really inexpensive. Um, so yeah, with the shipping already included. So if you're a planner girl and you want to try passport size for planning, or if you want to try ring um, pockets, I also can provide you with the rings that you can put in the pockets. Um, so you can see the kind of like DIY that they're doing. You know, you don't have to make holes through the notebook. Just get the elastic all coordinated so it can actually fit the rings in there and you can make that passport into a pocket ring so you can do that I actually that's why I bought it but didn't work for me because I'm not that kind of type of person <laughs> but um, but if any of you guys are interested you just let me know I will send you pictures through your email and I will send you a PayPal invoice and everything so we can make it official you know <laughs> But um, I, I haven't been into planning lately. I haven't used my Hobonichi, um, uh, Hobonichi what was it? Hobonichi, Hobonichi. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my gosh! I forgot. Uh, Hobonichi something. Oh, this, you see, this is how badly have I been because I haven't actually seen like use my Hobonichi, uh, Hobonichi weeks, <laughs> Hobonichi weeks, I haven't used my Hobonichi weeks in a long time, and so, yeah, I also haven't used my Hobonichi back in a long time, I've been into passport, um, I will talk about that in the video, because it's going to be a long video, and not a, well, it be a long video, it's a very detailed video so if you're getting into passport i mean journaling you want some tips and some ideas tell I'm, I'm telling you this is the place to be i'm not gonna tell you how to journal i'm not gonna tell you you should use the stickers you should use this pen if i have a recommendation on pens it's because i like them and i want to share them but it doesn't mean that you have to buy them okay so yeah I, I'm, pro I'm just gonna tell you like things that you should you could do if that is what you're trying to do in journaling but journaling is not about 
you should try and copy this person and copy their style. No, it's not about copying. It's about doing what you feel that is you. And I think people don't understand that. And sometimes I look into like other people journals on Instagram, and I was like, oh, those are really pretty and very aesthetic, and mine's like all crazy and stuff. But then I'm like thinking about it, like, well, this is my style. Like, this is my pr- like when I'm when I'm journal. You can totally see the kind of person that you are or the kind of person that the person is by just seeing and looking at the way of they, they journal, they write, they talk, and all that stuff. So that's why if you copy someone, you're not being yourself. And when the years pass, you look back at it. And if you remember yourself through the things that you do and the things that you write about, then that is what it counts. But if you look back to it, it's like, oh, I don't remember much about this. Or, I don't know what I did here, or blah, blah, you know? So, you really have to feel connected to what you're doing so you can actually feel like, okay, yeah, this is what I like, you know? This is something that I know I will look back at it, and I will enjoy it, and read it, and, and, and see how much I change, you know? So, journaling is not about copying someone. You can start by that if you feel like you're trying to look what, um, yeah, trying to find the way for journaling for you it, it, people copy a lot of other people most of the time when they're starting but um, after you do that try to find your way I think that's the most important thing when journaling um, so yeah <laughs> uh, I really do hope you guys um, join this video I'm sorry I keep uh, today at work I was really bad I almost gave a person well I didn't almost I gave a person six dollars and it was supposed to be thirteen dollars i literally didn't know what i was like and then later on that same person i was like oh wait this is yours and then the other lady was like no that's mine and i was like oh my gosh what am i doing <laughs> and then in the morning i was like uh, really it was a mess guys it was a mess like oh my gosh what am I doing? I, I I was thinking about because tomorrow and Sunday I have it off. And I was really happy about that because I really wanted to take a weekend off. So, I mean, my parents are kind of me doing everything and all that stuff before I go home. And I want to enjoy my time here. So, yeah. But, um, like I was saying earlier, the, I did a few spread on this kind of um, video. As you guys can see, I used more than two pages because being a passport is just a lot smaller and I'm the kind of person that I try my best to glue in as much as I can um, if I have like receipts if I have like um, tickets or if I have whatever I find on the way and I feel like it's going to look good or not even look good if I can like save them and look back at it it's like oh yeah I got this from this shop or I got this from like this guy that was important um, you know giving away this paper so I got this and that you know so if I have to like <laughs> glue in like three four five six pages of one day I will do it because I like that I like collecting so I would journaling for me is a lifesaver because it means that I can glue in paper that I don't want to trash <laughs> so I make an excuse why I'm saving them <laughs> so yes <laughs> but um yeah, I, I think journaling for me, um, passport size is has been a life changer. I do am trying the regular traveler's notebook size, but I'm using that for my journey. Um, Germany, I'm learning German, so I'm, I write everything down in in that notebook. Um, I also want to try a personal size for journaling because it's not too tall, it's not too small, and it's not sorry, it's not too like narrow um if i may say so it feels like i'm probably gonna like that size for journaling so that's a size that i would like to try um just a lot of things that i i really want to talk to you guys so if you're really interested in everything that i'm talking about right now journaling and all that really you should literally log into my um to this video that i will be making and if you're asking when would i be uploading that video it could be in between this week or next week. I'm not making any promise that it will be this week, 
but for sure I will try my best to upload it next week because I do try my best to schedule everything since I was in the cruise I wasn't able to upload um, exactly on Sunday when I got home from the cruise because I needed a time to like think about things and chill but um, now that I'm back I have videos that are being already edited I have videos ready to um, be edited or videos that I am recording like today I'm recording one or two of them so I want to be up to date with my channel because for the past few weeks I also being a lot of crazy and and all that stuff like going to this cruise guys I'm not even kidding like I talk a lot about this and I, I know you probably will be tired of me here of me saying this but this cruise literally inspired me and relaxed me so much that I am back here give me a second I believe someone is outside I get scared pretty easily like when I'm home, up home I don't know why I get scared so easily and because I'm not ready for anything everything is by surprise I'm like I want to have something so I can throw it to the person that walks into the room <laughs> so yeah um, but like I was saying um, what was I saying oh yeah uh, going to the schools actually really helped me you know I, I feel like more um, inspire every day I also look for videos every day for journaling videos um, I'm very picky with the videos that I that I choose because some videos are not my type of journaling so I don't watch them I am um, you know because I know I'm not gonna like them because they're not my type of journaling you know um, there are videos they're very simple in a way that they are more interest in aesthetic than writing or than actually journaling and hey like I said everyone has their own way of journaling but for me it's all about writing and yes about journaling and putting some ephemera and make it look pretty and and all stuff but I like to like remember this when I, um, I go back like you guys will see my flip through which actually now that I forgot uh, okay no wait oh my gosh okay so now things are changing <laughs> because I need to my flip through will be after hmm, okay so I'm, I will try and do my talking about the journal and all that stuff this week I will try my best to upload it this week because next week I have another journal with me and I am thinking maybe on Thursday or Friday I will be uploading a flip through of my travel journal in the cruise so yeah because that one is to be I need to do that one last because yeah and that one I already have it recorded and everything is I don't even have to edit it that much the only thing I have to do is I like, put some music in the background and it's real-time video so I won't be having any like um, fast forward or anything because yeah but if you guys want me to do a voiceover on everything that I wrote and everything that I was you know showing I can do that too so I can give you more insight because you know yes <laughs> but I'm really excited from what you guys are, from what I'm seeing right now I feel like I will be ending this whole video for me talking in it what <laughs> so um, yeah uh, um, so yeah guys I think I think you know what I think that's about it because I've been talking for a long time um, I want some water <laughs> I'm really thirsty oh wait I already drank the water that I thought I was going to drink oh god okay never mind so yeah um, I, I really hope you all have been enjoying my videos lately I'm sorry if I've been kind of like lost um, I do have a lot of things in my mind, you know, now that I'm back, I'm also moving, which that is something that I, I'm saying it like that, but I'm not 100% sure. I think I'm moving, but I need to go through a um, interview first, and after that interview, they're going to come in next day with the news if they're going to give me the job or not, because if they're not, then I'm staying here for a obviously. And not just that, the same day that I got arranged with the whole interview, 
they also offered me a job here in Puerto Rico to work in the same place that I'm working, but in the um, food, like in the cafeteria area. And they told me that we're gonna give you more hours and it's gonna be a lot easier. My schedule's gonna be like really early and I won't be getting out at least by 6 p.m. I'm already out, like because the cafeteria closes exactly like at 5 p.m. And so, yeah, so I think it's four or five, I'm not even sure. So, yeah, and they offered me that job. It's the same pay and everything, but with more hours. And I start like the, how do you say that? Um, the training, I started, I started the training on Monday. So I'm pretty nervous because this is a place that well, I have never been in it. This is the first time we play, um, working in this area but they say it's really easy so we'll see about that but um yeah guys i'm really really excited and at the same time it's like i don't know what i'm doing with my life because a lot of things are happening in my life so even thought i mean it's like my life is so busy lately like everything like this work this um the whole thing about the interview, about moving, trying to figure out what I'm gonna do, and, and all that stuff, mm -hmm. my family, my other job, because I work as a violin teacher, which I don't have a lot of students, but you know, I work here. So it's like a bunch of things, and not even like how messy it has been lately for the past few days, I have never once stopped journaling. And if it was me, they all cared for like two weeks ago, I probably will have will have never even touched a journal because I probably will be so busy with myself, with my own thoughts and all that stuff. So the Karen that came back from this trip is so completely different. I have goals in, I have kind of put my goals in front of me and also journaling, I took it more serious now. I took my relaxation time there. And to be honest, I wish I was there for like another week because I do need some relax time but that's why i'm here in the academy this is really relaxing air conditioned all the time which is a it's so good <laughs> and i brought my yoga mat so i can do some yoga and i also brought it because i can lay down a little bit later <laughs> um and i brought my uh, my pillow and my so i can also you know i brought some socks they're really really comfortable and i want to relax guys because you know what at home, I don't have that luxury, you know. I at home when I'm at home, I think about a bunch of things, and I don't feel like. Hmm, sometimes I don't even feel very. Oh, I forgot the word. So many words I've been saying, but whatever. <laughs> so I I really hope you guys um keep like watching my videos and you know supporting the channel and if you can share this video with all the um any of your friends that would be nice i really will appreciate that because i have to be honest guys i i don't know what i would do like i know a lot of youtubers say this and i'm like okay yeah whatever okay we get it you're like happy but to be honest i don't know where I will be if it wasn't for all of you guys, you know, subscribing, liking the videos, commenting on my videos, follow me on my Instagram. Like, you guys are pretty amazing, to be honest. And I'm really happy for each of you. And if I had, like, if I was like a millionaire or something, I would probably, like, be like, okay, what do you like? What kind of normal notebook you like? What kind of journal you like? Blah, blah, blah. And I'm going to give you all all of this. It's going to be for free. I'm going to give you a notebook, a traveler's notebook to all of you guys for free. I will send you to your, to your, mail, uh, to your mail, to your address, <laughs> wherever you're from. I don't care. I will pay shipping. <laughs> you know, I wish I had this, the money and, and, like, give you guys that because... This, like that's actually how I feel about you all. I'm like really, really happy from having you all in my life. I really am happy. You guys have made me happy. I'm I'm really happy. That's all I'm saying because I am. Like who would have thought that I, Karen Castro, will make a channel, which I love the name. I'm gonna be honest. It has been like 
and half a year or more and I still in love with my my name the channel that I came at the name that I came for the channel it was really good <laughs> and I have got 200 subscribers and I know for a lot of people it's like oh yeah but I mean I have thousand three thousand three hundred and the three hundred and something and thousand whatever and thousand thousand million billions <laughs> But I'm really excited for what I have and I really am thankful for all you guys. I really am. And please don't forget to always read my descriptions because I put a little extra note on my updates and how my life is going. So if you missed them on all my videos, just go back and watch them. And don't forget to give them a like on all my videos. <laughs> so I will catch you all in my next one. Um, and I will see you all later, guys. <laughs> Thank you for supporting me, for being there. And yeah, God bless you all. Have a wonderful day, guys, and take care. Bye. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.
right there. 